Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about how to simplify a fraction. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help to use Minute Math. We're given this problem here. We want to simplify 210 over 385. This is kind of a large fraction, so we want to break down the numerator and denominator to its prime factorization. Sometimes that can be the easiest. Let's start with 2. 10 here. 210 breaks down to be, well, I see a 21 times 10. Pretty easy. From there, 10 breaks down to be 2 times 5, and 21 is 3 times 7. Not too bad. Now 385. A little more difficult here. 385 is, well, divisible by 5, it ends at a 5. That ends up to be 77. Now, 77 is just 7 times 11, and we have prime numbers now left over. So we have the prime factorization of each number. Let's rewrite our fraction. Numerator, instead of 210, I can write this as 2 times 3 times 5 times 7, in increasing order, 2 times 3 times 5 times 7. In the denominator, same thing. We have a 5 times a 7 times 11. From there, we want to well, cross off our common factors. I see a 5 in the denominator and the numerator, and I see a 7 in the denominator and the numerator. What's left is a 2 times 3 in the numerator and 11 in the denominator. Now, 2 times 3 simplifies to be a 6 over 11, and there we have it. doesn't simplify anymore. And so 210 over 385, if you could guess it, was 6 over 11. I hope you learned something here on how to simplify a fraction. If you did, make sure you like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. This helps us make more of these free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching.